Hey guys, and welcome back. Oh my god, to part 8 of my Pokemon Scarlet and Violet um, walkthrough gameplay, whatever it is. And today we are. I think I got a new mic. Oh, wait, before we start off with this, let's go ahead and. Um, we've been mildly interrupted by the gym. Anyway, so I was. I wanted to say that we, in the last episode, um, went and caught myself. The one Pokemon I wanted to catch, a Finizen. So yeah, I was quite happy about that. We also got a Cyclozar, which I was quite happy about. Also, I got myself a new mic. I don't know if it's sounding well for you guys, but um, let me know in the comments below or whatever how the mic is for you guys. And um, yeah, <clears throat> well, before I do, let's get inside this gym. <clears throat> Alright, let's see what this is about. Va why Addy? What the? Okay. It's so wild that we ended up randomly visiting the same gym at the same time again. What a weird coincidence. I swear I'm not just sneaking ahead of you so I can get in line and wait and go. Oh wow, weird. Might be might as well battle you now that I'm here. No seriously, look, to prove it, I won't even challenge you to a battle this time. As much as I like to. <laughs> well look at you and your Pokemon. They've definitely gotten stronger since last time. Add these to the mix and you'll be hundred percent set to go, no problem. Ooh, three etters, that's pretty good. I'll be cheering for you. I'll go train like maybe 20 Pokemon or so while you tackle the gym. Alright, let's um, go here and talk to this person. Welcome to the Cortondo gym. Let me rescue you as a challenger. Your name is ID. Yes, it is. Right, great, now in order to face the gym leader, Katie, you need to first pass the gym test. Here at the Cortondo, that means taking on the olive roll. Olive production is a big part of life in Cortondo. Alright. Where is my phone? Oh, it's right there. Uh, we held the oil harvest here each year for generations in the bumper crops. To pass the gym test, you'll need to roll an olive-shaped ball all the way to the goal. Your efforts should be help ensure we get a th great oil harvest next year, too. The staff over the, at the olive rolling field will explain rules to you in further detail. I registered the location in your map app. It's just to the north of town. Now get out of here and have fun. All right. I guess we go there. Let me know guys if the mic is okay for you guys. I mean, I'm not sure if it's working well. Um, so let me, do let me know. Well, first, let me quickly go ahead and uh, do that, yep. Um, while we're here, we'll quickly heal up as well. I'm not sure, I don't think we really need to heal up, but might as well. Anyway, uh, let's go, I believe, I have to go to the olive rolling place, which is the, oh, a Jigglypuff just attacked us. Oh, no time for you, Jiggly. I want to keep you the lead Pokemon, because, yeah, because you'll just be good. Alright, we'll do the challenge here quickly. Welcome to the olive rolling field. Gym test is all about time. You need to push with all large rubber make it all the time. Get the ball over various obstacles and push it to into the goal to clear the course. Now that you've filled in, are you ready to stay in the gym chest? Yes, I am. Great. Put in a wish for the good olive harvest and roll, roll, roll away. All right, let's go. Um, this is going to be pretty interesting, not going to lie, but let's see how it goes. So, yeah. Those sounds are pretty weird. Anyway, here we go. Roll the olive. Jim, Chase, take on the olive roll challenge. Alright. Now, here we go. Alright. It's a lot harder than I thought, not gonna lie. This looks more like a ball and less like an olive. Can we get over this thing? So I think if we battle this lady here, 
Um, yeah. If you beat her. Well, you'll get some good XP as well. Alright, Gym Trainer Esmeralda. Let to see what Pokemon you've got. Dun -dun -dun. Uh, Cricketune. Interesting. Alright, we're gonna go for Pluck. Oh, close. Oh. You almost got us. And that should do it. I hope so. <laughs> It looks like you headed right past my smaller ball. I guess so. Okay, Team Smaller, time to clear the way. Wow, this last one was kind of being a jerk. It wasn't letting me get through. I um, I guess you. We'll... Well, this guy. I will battle this guy now. Should be pretty easy, considering they all have bug types. So, let's see. We are not getting enough XP, but the reason I know the reason for that is literally just because of the fact that um, <laughs> we we uh, are in a really low level gym. Even the small can tell how strong you are. They'll step aside for you now. All right, well, thank you. We did it. We did it. Gym test. I passed the gym test. Yay. Now right, let's see what's going to happen now. I hope something interesting. With that performance, I'm sure we can look forward to a great all of purpose next year. How to clear your gym test is officially cleared. Congrats. Please support your results to the lobby staffer at the gym. Good luck in your gym battle against Katie. Alright. We report to that gym all the way over. Ooh. Ooh, there's just a Fido's chilling with Jigglypuff. That's kind of cool. Uh, might go and heal up just so we can get our PP back. Watch the rest of the team should be all okay. Now come back and see a second when you need help. What's the one I didn't name? I didn't name Cyclazar. Hey, he's not going to be in the team for long, so. Um, I guess that's okay. Flabebe? What do you want, kid? Do you have the Pokemon Flabebe that can carry? It? Could you trade me a Flabebe for my Storm? I don't have one, buddy. Yeah, if I get one, maybe. All right, let's go talk to this guy here. Welcome back, Adi. I hear you're on a roll out there. And a big congratulations to me for the successfully cleaning gym test. You now earn the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck. Are you ready to face the gym leader, Katie, the sugar bug? Yes. Very well, I'm going to show you to the battle court. All right, let's do this. Well, here we go, battling Katie. Eat up, my little cutie, Viv Viv Vivian. I think it was Vivian, I'm not sure. Oh, what a lovely trainer you are. 
Thank you very much for your skillful olive rolling. It was quite impressive. Oh, did I forget to introduce myself? Forgive me. My name is Katie. I'm the owner here at the Passis Gym Soapberry. Oh, that's right. I'm, I'm not in my shop. I'm on duty as a gym leader of the Cortondo Gym right now. Forgive me. <laughs> my name is Katie, and I'm a gym leader here in Cortondo. My line of work is crafting sweets as a pastry chef. Little sweets that bring happiness with one bite. Bug-type Pokemon hiding in foliage. Both are small and yet very powerful. Don't let your guard down unless you'd like to find yourself getting knocked down by a feet. Alright, let's go. The songs, the sounds and the music is pretty interesting to hear. Alright, here we go. Gym Leader Katie. Nimble. Alright. Maybe I will use Zabe for this battle. Don't take my buck tap on the lightning. You will be in a world of pain if you do. Alright, we won't. Oop, I used the wrong move. A special attack fell. This is not that is not good. Dive! Oh yes, you can definitely learn that move. Um I'm gonna get rid of focus energy. Now we'll, we'll keep uh, Zappy out. That was pretty easy. Alright, who was the last one? What have you got for me, Katie? A Teddy Ursa. So th oh! So this is the one that she's gonna terrestrialize. Alright. Well, if you're gonna trust, let's show a lie. Break free from the cocoon and come onto your own, okay? Here we go, a bug type Teddy Ursa, that's so cool. Wow, it hit me four times in that move. But I'm pretty sure Zappy should flush it for us here. Yep. Sorry, Teddy, buddy, but I had to win that battle. No matter what. You wouldn't gain that much XP because it was just, we were just too a little bit too higher level for that. All my sweet little Pokemon dropped like flies. Sorry about that. The strength during our battle was like a nail, like a nice bread in the oven. I feel that I may need to work on my own strength as well. Congratulations, you passed. As proof of your victory against me, the gym leader, uh, allow me to present you with a gym badge. I hope you enjoy it alongside a heaping serving of some of my deluxe handmade treats. Ooh. Oh my god, we're enjoying those cakes. Oh, that's hilarious. Oh, we did it. That was just good. Alright, let's see what she has to say. With two badges in your gym possession, Pokemon up to level 30 will be easier to catch and will listen to your commands as well. I see you have quite the appetite as well. How about a little TM as a frosting on this cake? Pounds? Oh, so that's a new bug move, I think. Um, once you found a TM during your travels, you can then use a TM machine to make copies of that TM. Did you know that? You did know that, right? Wish you luck in your future adventures. Maybe, may they be as sweet and lovely as a good dessert. Thank you, Katie. Off you go then. Until we meet again. Alright, that was a, a pretty good gym battle. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Um, honestly, I think we could have done a little bit better there, but whatever. The game's the game. Pardon me, would you be the idea I've been hearing so much about? Nimona had a mention, er, mentioned there was a promising new face in the academy. Yes, indeed. 
Oh, I do apologize. I didn't mean to startle you by addressing you so suddenly. My name is Hassel. I'm one of the Elite Four of the Pokemon League. I also teach art class at the Academy. So, do tell me, young Addy, what compels you to collect these gym badges and strive to be a champion? I want to get stronger. Asked and answered. Thank you. Naturally, there's no single correct answer. All paths lead to the great crater of Paldea, as they say. You know your friend Nimona is the youngest to achieve champion rank in all of Paldean history. It is entirely possible that such great potential lies within you as well. Should, I, should you continue striving to reach champion rank, you'll one day have to battle me. You will be wise to train hard starting now. It will save you from experiencing the bitter regret of defeat. Oh, and do come along to my art class sometime. I would be thrilled to have you attend. Of course, at some point we might... We might actually make it, if we want. So, anyway, that was a good battle. Um, I guess we can make this kind of like... You can take on the Bombardier as well, I guess, which is the other Titan Pokemon in my, um, if I'm, well, there's another champ, there's another gym here, which is Psychic, which I don't want to take on just yet. We can, there's another screw base. I don't know the level of that, but where is the Titan Pokemon? It's here. Yeah. You're going to go ahead and take this guy on. There's an Igly buff. I'll break probably check that out as well, but I think I want to take on the Titan Pokemon. Um. So we get more stuff for uh, Koride on here. So I guess it'll be kind of like a two video thing. We'll take both of them on. Wait. I, did for I forgot to heal. Before we do that, let's go heal. Hello, Nurse Joy. But a lot of the rest of the team should be all be alright. Oh, and I went ahead and charged the tarot too. Seems to never need it. Thank you. And you probably want to hurt heal them. Yes, I know. Alright. Let's get out of here. To South Province Area 2. Wait, what the hell did we just hit? Oh, we hit an Igly buff. Sorry, buddy. You're not looking to battle you right now. That fight was really interesting in us. And uh, yeah, it's cool to see how I can interact with the Pokemon in this game. Ooh, Mareep. Oh, that's a Mabostiff. I'm one of those Pokemon. Right, good. Battle this guy. Let's battle you. Oh, oh, a Rockruff. I have I've seen you around school. You're the new transfer student, aren't you? Uh, let's go, old man, or some. Yeah, what the? How are you a student? You've got a beard, bro. And looks like you've got white hair as well. But yeah, but I just ain't gonna work out well for you. The UK is really shaking things up. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for clapping as well. Really appreciate it. I'm gonna check out this outbreak. Is it? Oh, so that's what it is. It's just a bunch of them. That's cool. I don't see any shinies. Shiny? I don't think I want to battle too many of them, but yeah. Ooh, is this just a bunch of these things here? Uh, I forgot their name. We'll catch them. We'll, once we're trying to complete the Pokedex, we'll come back and catch you guys. So, um, yeah, let's head. Ooh, that's one of those ones. That's a grass and fire type. Awesome. There's a Nimble over there. Rock Rough. What Pokeball? Have you ever seen one of those pillars in a light? You can spot them far away. 
Uh, all right, what Pokemon do you have? A Shuppet. Okay. Later up here. I thought that would knock. I thought it was going to be super effective, but okay. Ooh, there's a Mankyu that can get an Annihilab if you want as well. I want to get a Houndstone, even though, it's, even though my Crocodile will evolve into a Fire Ghost type, but I really just want to. I just want a Houndstone as well. So, um, there's one thing up there. Okay, so we go up from this way, I think, if I'm correct. Um, I have no idea where we're supposed to go, but I think I'm figuring it out. Um, what the hell did I just hit? I hit a Nimble. Well, Nimble, you don't want to battle this. Uh, you don't want to battle my Votril. Might as well just... There's so many Pokemon here. You can easily... You won't even realize if you hit one of them. Ooh, there's a Terrastalized Pokemon over there. Before I battle you, kid, I want to check that out. Okay, that's all the way on the other side. A belly bolt uh, pre evolution. Uh, what are you? You're a tad bulb. Oh, nice. Nice name, though. Okay, we can't get there, but what is that Pokemon? Oh. Well, once you unlock, maybe like. There's a Mudbray there. Oh, is it down there? Okay, so that turret ter thing was down here. Uh, change Pokemon. Ooh, it's a Marshall. Um, I will use you for this battle. Yeah, I think it's much better to do it that way. Alright, here we go. Another one of these. Is it a mouse hold or is it called something else? Only one of them has the hat as well, that's hilarious. Oh, they're called Tandemos. Okay, that's what they're called. Marshall is its evolution, I believe. Here we go. Needed it. That was pretty good. Mm. 
There goes the Pokeball. Alright, let's catch this thing. Mm-hmm, we did it. We caught it. Tandemos. Alright, we got... Oh, we did get some good candies from it. Alright, that was pretty good. Um, yeah. So I guess we're gonna go over to... I think I'm gonna end the video because then it's gonna get a little bit too much. So, yeah. Tandem Mouse is a normal type. Um, uh, you can send it to a box. Uh, yeah. Alright, anyway, anyways guys, thanks so much for watching and um, don't forget to like and subscribe guys. And if you enjoyed this video, then do the things I said in the last, that I just said before this. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.